What up guys, my name is DJ Gundla, back at it again. I'm back here in the studio to draw some more comments today. You know, today's comments are better than ever. I'm sure a lot of you have a lot of friends who watch the Chala channel that would be very pleasantly surprised to see a Chala hoodie in their gift bag. Or if you don't have any friends like me, you can always do a gift for yourself for being productive. You can get yourself one of these bad boys, I'm joking. These bad boys are getting somewhat old and we are here today to change that. We are here to draw some brand new merch designs. If you missed this community post, shame on you. I do these every now and then, like every couple of months. The last one was six months ago. Draw what you think your average viewer looks like. This has always been popular. An onion crying while watching a human being cut in pieces. Not the bad idea. Although it is a little bit bad. Draw Bob the Builder in a Winx Club outfit. Hey, that's that's pretty lol. <laughs> Elon Musk sending Joel merch into space. This is related to some current events in the world and uh, all that good stuff. Yeah, that's a good idea. Although, how would you depict that as a merch item? I wonder. This is the best one so far. A hoodie that has Chola written on it in the supreme style. I feel like every YouTuber could easily do that. A shirt with a goth furry girl and the words nothing is impossible. Yeah, 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 that's cool and all, but you can only take the irony so far. This is like a comment reading. I'm not, I don't want to draw any of this shit. A loaf of Chola bread with Chola written on it in some weird and fancy font. I do like that one actually. I want to draw some Chala bread now. I'm saving this one. PewDiePie fighting off the Dragon T series with memes. Yeah, that's cool and relevant and all that jazz, but like, it's like if I would would make draw with jazz merch. The 12 soon guy having a birthday party. Maybe he will be 13 soon. I don't know how old he really would be if, if he aged like a normal person, like one year per year. Socks, designed with the Chala worm. Sticking your feet in the cello worm. Good job, boy. Oh, Ingles 7395. The cello worm hasn't received any attention in a while. I think it'd be cool to have a black and white sweater with a nicely drawn chair of any sort in the center and cello on the sweater arms. Minimalist aesthetic. So now we have four comments to start off with. So let's get to it. Let's try to cook some crap up here. All right, so what I see is um, the 12 soon guy is having a birthday party. His birthday cake is a shell of bread. He is sitting in a nice armchair. Imagine me being the 12 soon guy and a bread being here. Let's try to sketch some crap. But first I need to see what the shell of bread looks like because I don't know what it looks like. So I need to see what it looks like if I want to draw that shit. We also need a cool ass armchair. Dope chair. That's pretty dope if I do say so myself. Oh man. That's cool. Holy moly. Man, that, that that seems pretty fitting. There's even a color variation here. This is a fan art of Chala's character. Dude, what the hell? I just... I, when you search for dope chair, you get fan arts of my goddamn Sienna Mon character with the chairs. Although this chair isn't very cool, I'd say. No, it's a cool fan art nonetheless. Oh, I like that pink one. That's dope. That th truly is some dope furniture. Okay, so now it is time to finally get to sketching some crap. He's in a very nice position, in the very excited position. Actually, I want this to be like a round, round table because I feel like there's gonna be a lot of round shapes in this picture. I'm gonna use this plugin called Lazy Nizumi and I'm gonna use a perspective ellipse to construct this darn table. Now that's what I'm talking about. Now we can just draw a simple circle like that and bam we've got ourselves a nice aft table i love this tool it's a great time saver i love how i would personally never wear my own merch designs other than the logo <laughs> one now let's do that dope aft chair in the back there now for the chala bread man this is difficult to get right i don't understand the pattern at all let's do like candle or maybe even 13 candles this is the basic idea so yeah for now i'm just gonna keep these simple as just ideas still as drawings because this is drawing your comments after all who would wear this <laughs> comment below i want to actually refine this dude a bit i'm gonna give him some teeth maybe although the teeth are probably a turn off for most people Okay, this is epic. Now, he be the style king. He's got that black sweatshirt. 
This mofo had purple eyes. Very nice. Now let's do the hat. I think it should be green to stand out from the pinks and crap. And now the bread will fall into the oranges as well. Keeping the picture nice and consistent in the color department. Very nice. Very good. Let's do a background. I feel like I want to complete the circle here with the background color. And this text will fill up this area over here yeah boy first merch item done your pfp but instead of your hands making peace signs one does x and the other d not glasses like your header just the hands either the hands are normal or extremely deformed it gets up to you bud how would you do an x with uh, with just one hand and how would you do a d a gold chain that says Holagund Lair. <laughs> Holagund Lair. Someone with a vape that captures ghosts. I think uh, the vape would actually cause ghosts to escape into the world. You just vape out some ghosts. You know like those weed socks you can get? Those but with XDs. I want to mix this together with the damn Chala, <laughs> Chala Worm socks. Damn, dude. All right, so now we got to perform some thinking. What could we possibly do here? Okay, first of all, I want to sketch out those darn socks to see what those suckers would roughly look like. I guess the body of a worm and here would be the head and here would be the damn face and yeah then you can just stick your foot right in there you could also combo these very nicely with your green with your sup the cello sweatpants some good attire for the whole family i think i would want different forms of xds like maybe some small X's and the capital D's and let's uh, leave that for the time being and let's concentrate on that uh, ghost capturing vape. So let's draw that uh, squatting mofo. There we go. There's one hand and the other hand is supposed to be handling the device that blows vapor he be being like this he it do be like that sometimes that's a nice meme that i actually enjoy way more than like surgery and grapes or whatever the hell is going on these days there we go this is how it be on one foot i feel like he needs a very interesting looking face to show that he is interesting as a person now very nice we're getting there i'm just doing some pac-man ghosts right now because i don't know what the what how to depict the ghost at the current moment without looking anything up so the concept is the same. The vape ghost is going to be <laughs> blown there in the center and he's looking down. Here's the ghost's eyes and and yeah, this that's how it goes, man. This way the design would be more compact. And you could also see the socks right next to the ghost. I want the dude to have some kind of hair or something at least. Maybe this shall be, is this happening with his nice ass hair? Actually, maybe this could also be someone we all have grown to love. See an Ammon who randomly pops up on Google image results if you search for dope chair. That's the level of popularity this guy's reached. That should be celebrated with the dope merch design. I'm starting to realize how bad of an idea this was. I think he's repping some bright red today to show how bold and confident he is. He can vape with confidence. Not many people can say that. Please do not try to replicate this design, guys. For the love of God, don't create fan art of this. You know what, for the vape, I want to go with some cool brush. some quick ass shading to finish things off here ah oh. that's my reaction to me creating stuff like this again i want to put some epic filters in this image all right we're getting closer i just need to do some Ross Tran type of shit it's color dodge time whoa look at that whoa Holy moly. All right, that's all for the merch. This wouldn't be merch anyway, but this is just regular drawing your comments now. You know, now that I'm not thinking about things being merch, I, I want to do the Elon Musk thing for 
the thumbnail. I see one of those, uh, can you photoshop the moon to be between my fingers or I don't know whatever the hell that picture was. I want to do that thing, but instead there's like a rocket in there launching and he's here wearing cello merch also. Something like this. Let's also turn it into a beautiful composition just like that. He also be doing that, haha. <laughs> I feel like this should be a very beautiful black and white painting with a lot of texture and just gonna use a lot of random brushes for a lot of goodness, a lot of emotion because if uh, the thing is in black and white you focus a lot more on the actual contents and emotions of the scene. This is an emotional moment that goes down in history so it needs to be depicted accordingly. <laughs> Put a bright halo around the rocket to bring that sucker out. Sunlight gonna be coming down from the sky. Now let's bring in a little bit more contrast to this. And let's also do a gradient map for that top-notch color. This is the type of shit I'm all about. Have your OC drink out of a chill lock up that has some purple slash green liquid dripping out of it. Yeah, I mean, sure. This is good material to mash with the different common. If you're cool with drawing this, I'd like to see Dwayne the Rock no, Johnson wearing booty shorts cool with and a tank top. No, maybe doing Shut something up. kind of draw a person with no thumbs trying to use a tablet. I like that. I like the no thumbs thing. That's creativity at its core. So the person who is drinking out of that cup with the green slash purple liquid does also not have any thumbs. But who is it? A jelly skeleton. It's just gonna be a damn skeleton drinking green liquid from a cup while not having any thumbs trying to use a tablet or something. I'm doing it, boys. I'm drawing the skeleton. This sucker be holding that cup very gracefully. Right, but no thumbs. He needs to hold the tablet flat on his palm like this because the thumbs aren't there. Maybe he spills some of the drink on, on the tablet. Who, who knows? The skeleton is resemblant to that <laughs> thing that was in my last old art video. Yeah, that's a good opportunity to draw that character. No thumbs or no lower jaw. This is perfect, man. Now, I need to reference my arm, my own arm. How would you hold a cup? What's the closest thing to a cup here? It's a candle, hey. <laughs> so if I were to hold this without using my thumb, I would probably do it somehow like this. Very nice. So now I can reference this. This is an iPad Pro 2018. This is the newest version and the sucker be spilling some damn slime on this. All right, she had anime eyes as well, I forgot about that. It's not very apparent that the sucker doesn't have any thumbs, but who cares about that? I don't. Some content is being viewed on the tablet. Maybe she is watching Chala. That's what I want for the background. Also, I feel like the cup needs to be of a little bit of a different color to stand out. Now we gotta make this look like jello or some crap. I don't know how to do that, but I'll give it the shot. So my theory is, uh, in parts where there's some more stuff going on behind the thing, it gets darker. So this area is dark because there's also the bone that comes out from the shoulder behind this bone right here in the front. I don't know, that's the way I'm thinking about this right now. So technically the whole f face would be pretty dark because there's the hair behind there. I mean, it's working a little bit, Not maybe not as intensely as I'd like. I'm gonna put like a rim light into this and see how that plays out. Now the top up facing parts will have some of that whiteness. I already did that, that's the very first thing, but let's intensify that shit. Nice, I like that. This is a good challenge. This is by far the best pick I've drawn into the in today session. I want the drink to be somewhere between green and purple, so let's make it be of like 
this kind of color. Some highlight areas here. Let's make it drip down a little bit over the fingers maybe. Oh, damn, dude. Oh yeah, it was supposed to be spilling on the tablet. Oh snap, that's dangerous. Let's finish this pickup now. A little bit of dodge and burn to burn the dark parts. Anyway, yeah, this is good. This is cool, dude. All right, let's go for the last one. Then I'll have enough merch ideas for today. And I'm pretty tired already. I've been recording this for the whole darn day. Just up portrayed as a mother bird feeding his younglings clickbait videos. Not gonna draw this, but I like this one a little bit. New but inferior T-posing. I like how somebody remembers new but inferior because he's so inferior. I, I, I just can't decide, man. I'm just gonna use a random number generator. And if the comment that uh, I land on does suck ass, then I'll still draw it. Comment number eight is what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm scared. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A shade of nail polish that represents you, Chala. I'm a man of my word. I want to see what uh, epic nail polish looks like. That's pretty cool. Ghoul, it's a brand called Epic Nail. I'm gonna design an epic nail polish bottle. It's gonna be post-apocalyptic. <laughs> Well, there you have it, son. That's my nail polish. It's why I don't do random number generators. I was actually thinking of doing an episode just with random number generators where I don't get to choose anything but damn. If I'm not in the right mindset, that just results in some crap like this. It might look decent to some of you, but it's totally soulless. So yeah, that, that pretty much concludes this video. This one was my favorite. This one was my least favorite. So, girls and boys of all ages in the Chala fandom who are watching this video currently, look forward to brand new merch, or I don't even know if I'm actually gonna make new merch or not, but if, if in case I'm not gonna make new merch, do buy this shit right here, because look at how cool this is. You'll be the most sophisticated looking mofo at school. Your crush will just come running to you and asking you, Damn, dude, you looking fresh today. Where'd you cop that? And then you can tell them, sup to Chala and turn your back on them to impress them. This video was a big advertisement, so <sighs> it's okay if the artworks are a little bit soulless. It's all good. <laughs>